talk to you a little bit about how you can put together a workout for the water instead of the land. Um, so in the water, we have a lot of resistance created by that water, so that helps us out. We can use body weight, we can use just our limbs, you know, our parts of our body, or we can use some kind of tools. Uh, we have some specific aquatic tools like these water weight dumbbells and these little paddles. And then we also have just generic like pool tools like this pool nickel here. Um, so really you can use anything to um, create a workout. And I always tell everybody, um, anything you can do on land, I can do in the water. And sometimes you can do it even better in the water because you have to push against that water. So if I was gonna put together just kind of a little high intensity interval training for um, a client in the pool, uh, it might go something like this. So I might have them start off with punches and their weights would be down in the water. So that water, we're having to push and pull through that water. And then we might grab our pool noodle and we might use that pool noodle for rows. We're gonna pull that down through the water for you know, a certain amount of seconds, like maybe 60 seconds or so. And then we might switch to these paddles. Um, these paddles just kind of slip onto your hands and they're made for working out in the water. Um, you can also just use your hands themselves. They create quite a bit of resistance as well. Um, so I might do an ab exercise with these, meaning, um, so I might push and then push. So I'm pushing the water from side to side really work in that core and then I might finish by grabbing having them grab a kickboard and I have them turn sideways a lot of times bury it down in the water straighten their arms and they're just going to run laps across the pool while they're pushing this um, that creates a lot of resistance it's harder than you think to push something through the water um, so when you where you can run really fast on the land you might be able to move as fast in the water to get twice the work out of it because you're having to push through that water itself. Um, so that's just kind of a little um, thrown together, a little routine. You could repeat that as many times as you wanted to. Then switch to some new exercises. So give it a try and let me know what you think.